almost just broke down crying because today is just one of those days. Sentry is very, very irritable. He's whining. He's been whining since he woke up this morning. And it's just non-stop, y'all. It's non-stop. And I just keep on telling myself, just be calm, be calm, be calm, be calm. And I keep on thinking to myself, this is not going to last forever. You know, he's two years old. It'll be a couple of years from now when he's not going to, you know, want you to do anything for him. He's not going to want to have anything to do with you. So just try to be patient. It's just one of those days and I just feel like I'm going to lose it. But thank God. Thank God. For God because prayer is really what's keeping me sane. Prayer and me just talking to myself, like just using my conscience to constantly say, it's gonna be okay. Just be patient. Don't worry about it. It's okay. He's okay. He's healthy, you know. It's like he's just whining for no reason and I don't know what he wants. And it's just so, so, so frustrating. Y'all, it's just like nails on a chalkboard sometimes. And I can like just feel the hairs on my back just standing up because it just stresses me out. And I'm just trying to keep calm about it. I'm trying so hard. So I'm just praying that he takes a nap today. Um, just hoping and praying he takes a nap today because it's going to give me time to actually just take a breather and relax and just detox, I guess. I don't even know the word for it, but y'all, he's just so different than what Katie was like. Katie was so easy. Like, she was such an easy kid growing up. Um, I mean, she did great at daycare. She played well with others. She never cried when I had to leave and go somewhere. She was just easy to please, and she played by herself. And she's just not independent, but, like, she didn't need me. Like, she wasn't on my tail every day, all day, 24-7. Like, I could go to the other room and she would be perfectly fine. This child is a whole different story. He's like a whole little level and y'all, God is showing me patience. This. Mama, this is mama. This is literally the calmest he's been all morning. Every day, every day it's a meltdown. Every single day. Dang. Every single day, century. Oh gosh, but yeah, I just had to come on here and just let y'all know. It's just that, Mama. Let y'all know what I'm going through it's right now. That. I'm just worn out. Like this morning, he was eating cereal, wasted the cereal in the bed, so I haven't even cleaned it up. I just, I just had to walk away, y'all. I literally just had to walk away because he was crying at the same time and I just had to just leave and go into the other room because it was just too much for me. Anyways, if you're a mom out there and you can relate, girl, you're not alone. You are not alone. I'm going through it. It's a, I'm surprised like I haven't pulled every single inch of my hair out of my head like Oh, it gets bad, it gets bad. But y'all, we will survive. We are doing great. You're doing great as a mom and you're the best mom for that child. Y'all just wanted to just come on here real quick and let you guys just see like, just I just had to speak my mom for a moment and just let you guys know that you're not alone. Look, me and you, we right here. We right here, girl, I see you. But you're doing great.